Oracle, you know of my solemn vow to attain the throne at any cost. Tell me, what obstacles still stand in my way? I have looked into the future, and I have seen that you will be killed by your nephew. My nephew? You mean the one my sister gave birth to like two days ago? Yes, that's the one. He's gonna kill you. Oh. Uh... Well... Squire, I have a mission for you. Yes, my lord. I have been told by an oracle that one day my nephew is going to rise up against me and kill me. You are to seize him and dispose of him. Yes, lord. How shall I kill him? Shall I slice his throat? Slice his throat? What is wrong with you? He's a baby. Shall I bash his head in then? No! Drown him in the river? No! Burn him alive? Okay, you seem weirdly eager about killing this infant. Please don't do any of those things. Then... what do you want me to do? I just want you to take him out into the woods and abandon him there. In the cold. To die. But then how will you know if he's really dead or not? Squire, think about it. Do you really believe a two-day-old baby could survive in the woods on their own? No, but- Babies cannot hunt food or build shelters, come on, use your head. But could he not be adopted by a wandering shepherd and then raised as that man's child until he comes of age? If you take him far enough away into the woods, away from civilization, that wouldn't be a problem. But even then he could be raised by wolves. Raised by wolves? Squire, are you listening to yourself? Please just leave him out in the woods where no one will find him and the job will be done. No throat slicing. Just because we're killing an infant doesn't mean we can't be civilized about it. I am just worried about the wolves, lord. Forget about the wolves! Just follow my orders. Yes, my lord. It shall be done as you say. Who is this mysterious youth who fights so well? They say he has no parents, my lord. And that he was raised in the wild by wolves. Raised by... wolves? Lord Tyrant, I have come for your head at last. Who are you? I know not who I am. Only that my father abandoned me in the forest as a child where I was raised by wolves for the next 20 years before starting my quest to kill you. Oh. Oh no. Oh poo. Oh poo is right. Prepare to die, tyrant. Well, it looks like your prideful attempt to flee your fate only made you meet it faster. Isn't that ironic? Shut up, squire. It's too bad there was nothing you could do to prevent this. I said shut up! I told you I should have slit that boy's throat. The way you were acting that day, I do not want you slicing any baby's throat. You were being very weird about it. What, what are what are you two talking about? Nothing, nothing. Just go ahead and kill me if that's what you were planning to do. Okay. <laughs> Let this be a lesson to us all, never to go against the will of the gods.